Thousands of children are homeless in New York City, and when the winter comes around, things become even more challenging. Ten years after her own period of homelessness, Orange is the New Black actress Jackie Cruz partnered with Hoodies for the Homeless to provide jackets to over 60 children. Honestly, the best thing that Orange is the New Black gave me was my voice. Yes, I was at the lowest. I almost died, and then I turned it around. So, you know, I feel like even not having a home when you're young, I don't know, it makes you strong. And I, I feel like, I don't know, you learn from that and you become something bigger than that in the future. So these kids, they have a future. I just want, I want them to know that. As a teenager, Cruz and a friend decided to pack up and leave home. Even though my mother changed her whole life for me and moved from the Dominican Republic to LA so I could pursue my dreams, I, uh, I, was, I wanted to be bad. I didn't like her rules and I wanted to move out. And she told me, being an adult is not easy, but if you want to do it, don't come back, because she didn't want me to leave. With plenty of snacks, books, and a big red dog in tow, Cruz and the Hoodies for the Homeless Foundation set out to make a difference. You learn the figures and facts about homelessness just here in New York City, and it's mind-blowing. And you, what's even more mind-blowing is how many people have no idea that would way, way, way undershoot that number. So awareness is a big deal, and what, what celebrity uh, people who are very successful in entertainment like she is bring is, is awareness, the access to people. I do speeches all over the U.S. for teenagers and, you know, college students. And I, I feel like each one of them talks to me how my story, like, is so similar to theirs and, like, inspires them. And they're actually inspiring me. So I, I'm telling you, like, just having an influence is so special. And I, I want to do it good with it. You know what I mean? And let's not forget the photo ops. I, I do selfies once in a while, but All right, man. <laughs> selfies do. and the mannequin challenge. That's okay. <laughs> you gotta have fun too. You gotta have fun. I, I did it with my you little sister. <laughs> Founder and ex-marine Tavis Eaton's empathy for homelessness is founded in the plight of homeless veterans as well as something deeper. Even adding on top of that, and maybe even more, is New York City and his love of the city and his own experience with. I mean, he had to fend for himself when he was a kid. He had to make his own meals at twelve and. Um, you know, because his mom worked two two jobs, and so he really had to hustle and struggle on his own. And so I think he identifies. And, and Tavis has slept on a park bench here in New York City before. He's you know, he's never really struggled with homelessness, but he's definitely struggled. Beyond donating clothing, crews and hoodies for the homeless believe more can be done to help those in need. I don't agree with turning your head. You never know what's going on in someone's life. What's a dollar? It's hard to turn away. I just feel like. Especially in New York, it's so cold. Like, you don't want to give money, all right? Bring someone food or, or a blanket or something, you know? Yeah. Or even a conversation, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Uh, one of the big issues as I've continued to learn about homelessness is people who are homeless feeling like the outside of society, giving them an opportunity to feel human. Just yeah. if you don't want to give money, okay. And yeah, there are mental health issues, and that's something that you have to deal with with homelessness, but. Yeah. Strike up a conversation. Educate yourself. With 25,000 homeless children in New York City alone, Hoodies for the Homeless offers a warm heart in a cold situation.